This is Patrick Collatenfenner from Safer Networking Limited with a new screencast on post SpyBot 2.0 progress. Some of the feedback we received on version 2 was that the user interface was providing more information than necessary. The focus of this screencast is to show some steps in improving that. I'll start demonstrating using the rootkit scan. This was already divided into a quick and a deep scan. We improved on that by updating our user interface concepts to show a standard simple view with an advanced view whenever requested. It will become visible, for example, when looking at our immunization. While previously the screen was filled with a large list of possible entries, it now has a simple overview of what's up, and only when you want to see details you can have them show up. The system scan is another example. Instead of having the additional progress dialog showing up, we've integrated that as our new simple view. And only if you've got uh, malware um, and you want to see it in detail, you'll need to switch to the advanced page. Finally, this is also valid for the updates. It was criticized that the updater showed the full list of files Bible uses, and we agree that you usually don't need that much information. So here's our simple view. Another small change we've made is to the file scanner. No longer will there be separate lines for heuristic and standard scans grouped by file name. We now have single lines per file grouped by status to avoid even more confusion should other scanning engines be added here. Also, we now show your file has been flagged as uh, good because of whitelisting. Please keep in mind that the changes you've seen are a work in progress. That needs some more visual polishing. We at Safe Networking wish you a happy new year.